Hi, I'm Randy Reed. It's Today in Lighting.com. Tuesday, 3 September, and I hope you had a wonderful Labor Day. We're sponsored by Phillips Advanced, the name in quality components. Our celebrity shout out this morning goes to Peter Augusta. Peter and I were together last week in Knoxville for the inauguration of the lighting for the Henley Street Bridge. Good morning, Peter. Here are the stories making news. Amber Case's keynote at IES 24, the lighting conference, emphasized calm technology, advocating for designs that seamlessly integrate into our lives without disruption. She highlighted how lighting and tech should enhance, not intrude on, human experience. More at designinglighting.com. The GSA Health and Buildings Roundtable focused on integrating circadian lighting into modern workspaces. Experts discussed overcoming barriers between energy codes and circadian needs, highlighting the benefits of well-timed lighting for health and productivity. That article is at edisonreport.com. In episode four of the Lighting Matters podcast with hosts Avi Moore and Lisa Reed, Paul Bill of 18 Degrees discusses his shift towards sustainability, focusing on rescuing and repurposing flat panel light fixtures. God bless them. We link to that full episode at designinglighting.com. The NASDAQ had a strong day on Friday and lighting had a great day. Everyone was up except for LSI and their loss was slight. That's it. Go light up the world. Have a great short week. Pray for peace.